We begin tonight at 6 with a terrifying start to the day for a family in Orange County. Authorities tell us an SUV was being pursued by state police when it drove right into the home in Newburgh. CBS 2's Tony Aiello spoke with the homeowner who was still shaken up. The day after the East Coast earthquake, it looks like one hit this house in Orange County. We were shook up early in the day and now, you know, closing the day with, with being shaken up again. So Matt Dembinski says humor is helping him deal with a nightmare situation. This was nearly tragic. It was surreal seeing it. 2 a.m. Saturday, a vehicle being pursued by state police smashed into his home of 22 years. An immense explosion, what it felt like. It basically knocked me you know, out of my bed. Dembinski immediately thought of his twin daughters, local basketball stars Alex and Sam. The car breached Alex's bedroom wall. Her wrist is a little banged up, so we had to get her chase. It's not her shooting wrist, though, so... <laughs> State police say 21-year-old Hector Balbuena is facing multiple vehicle and traffic law charges. He allegedly fled from troopers during an attempted stop, leading to a brief pursuit before the crash. Neighbors say it happened on a dangerous curve with a safe speed limit posted at 15 miles an hour. One of our cars has been hit here in the past. You know, they hit my brother-in-law's truck and took the bed right off of it. Were you here when they pulled the car out? Yeah, we were here when they pulled the car out. What were you thinking? I was thinking the house was going to fall down on top of the rest of the house. Yeah, it was scary. The homeowner is waiting to hear back from town engineers and his insurance company. State police tell me prior to impact, the pursuit lasted less than one minute. Still, like all police pursuits, it will be reviewed to see if protocols were followed. In the town of Newburgh, Orange County, Tony Aiello, CBS 2 News.